We are here with another artist for this coming weekend, Art in the Park 2022. We have Ingrid Anderson. Ingrid, how are you today? I'm good. How are you? I am doing well. I take it you are, are you in your studio? I see the art in the back. Well, <laughs> this is the painting that I did kind of as my living room, actually. Okay. Because, okay. Um, I wanted, I knew I wanted to have a colorful backdrop. And so yep. this is, it's actually um, done on a canvas that's stapled to the wall. Okay. Which means I can take it with me wherever I go which is oh, kind absolutely. of a fun way to do instead of a mural on the wall sure which i can't take with me no <laughs> then wherever i go i can take this with oh, me well that is a great idea well tell me a little bit about about how you got started uh doing art so i honestly don't remember because i've been doing art for so long okay. um, but my mom is fond of saying that she was she very early on discovered that um she could have hours and hours of quiet time if she gave me art supplies oh that's smart that's smart mother <laughs> yeah <laughs> so um you know she has drawings from when i was 18 months and i was wow, okay. already um back then drawing people was my my favorite thing okay. and those people looked more like circles with you know dots and sure. all kinds of, of funny but whatever yeah um but yeah so people were always the thing that i drew most okay I, sure so and still so still today still people, today one of your you, favorite things that, yeah okay were yeah. absolutely one of my favorite things i go okay. a little more abstract on it yeah sometimes and sometimes i go more real but um people so so you love people do you have any uh, favorite themes or or colors uh that, well, that you like to paint in so obviously like i just said people yeah um yeah. also landscapes and i i really like to paint sort of abstract dream dreamscapes so yeah. a lot of my my paintings are actually inspired by by dreams or um i guess it would be the the sort of dreams you get when you're in a, in a meditative state because for me painting is a very meditative process there's a, a very different that. mind space that i go into okay and um so I just kind of let that flow. Okay. So you talk about dreams inspire you. Are there any, uh, so do you, but all these years you've been doing art, are there any artists or any people who inspire you? I am very inspired by um, both the expressionists and, um, oh my goodness, <laughs> the uh, Renoir, the impressionists. I was like, okay. hey, I know which artists. <laughs> Why can't I remember what style that's called? Uh, uh, you know this stuff. I love it. I love um, it. So. But I, I love Renoir and I love uh, Monet. The okay. their way of capturing light and color, just and the the life that is in their paintings that just moves. I love that yeah. so much. Um, but I love the expressionist artists as well. Their okay. way of uh, really pulling out. Um, Sorry, let me pause the notifications here. Uh, there we go. So um, I love their way of pulling out things that are real or not real. That, but but their inner, the inside, their inner scape, so to speak. Yeah. And now where do you go, go ahead? Just, I'm sorry. Uh, just and making that oh. visible. Yeah. Oh, definitely. So where where do you like to? Where do you like to paint? I mean, studio, outside, in your living room? Anywhere. Okay. I mean, I, I, I don't have a studio per se. Okay. So, okay. Um, but anywhere in the apartment is okay. game. Sure. And there's so many times, like, I will, if I know I'm going somewhere where I'm going to be sitting for a while and I'm going to have downtime, you better believe I'm going to have my watercolors, my paints. Okay. I've got, I mean, this is this is literally next to me at all times. Okay. Um, <laughs> and I'll have those with me and I will sit and, and just paint while I'm having that downtime. So I was um, at a meeting just last week where okay. um, actually Sharice Davis was there and it was kind of cool. Oh, and okay. I was painting while people were talking because okay. I remember things better when I'm painting. I've heard that, yeah. Oh, that's excellent. That is excellent. So 
obviously you're going to be at Shannon Valley Park, uh, Art in the Park, this coming Saturday. Where else can people uh, see your art on display? So primarily right now, you can see it on either Instagram or Facebook. Okay. And, um, Half Sun Art at both of those. I okay. prefer Half Sun Arts, but it wasn't available. So <laughs> um, Half Sun Art it is. Okay, so. excellent. Uh -huh. And I'll, I'll, I'll put the links uh, uh, down below in, in the notes so people can click those and uh, and see. So tell, what are you going to be having at uh, Art in the Park for people to look at so and for people to buy? Right. So I'm going to have a lot of my smaller paintings. Um, yeah. If they get here in time, I will also have some coloring books that I've been working on. Oh, um, yeah. And uh, but we'll see. Hopefully okay. they get here in time. I'm, uh, the shipping may, yeah. may or may not work out. Um, but I'll also have the painting that not not the big trees one, the smaller painting okay. that you see behind me. I'll have that one and some other things like it there. Oh, as well. wonderful. And I presume, I do want to ask the question though, that when someone comes up, if they, they like what they're seeing, but they perhaps maybe want a, a larger size or some different color, you you do do commission work, don't you? I do commission work. Um, I don't replicate things I've done before. Right, yeah, well, I understand. So I, I won't do that, but I, I can absolutely do commission work and okay. um, and enjoy that. That's, sure. that's a great thing. Excellent. And, um, and they get they can talk to you at uh, Art in the Park or absolutely. your contact or information. They can message me on, on either of those, yeah, Instagram or or Facebook, and I'll Wonderful. be happy to to discuss. Excellent. Well, we are looking forward to seeing you uh, mm -hmm. on Saturday. It is uh, ten to four. I think everyone's yep. probably gotten one of these in the mail, and your and your pictures on here. Your your art. That's one. Right that's there, right. so yep, right, right above Janie's head. So, is there any, <laughs> anything else you'd like to share with with the people watching? This um, uh, let's see. Well, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to seeing people and um, yeah. love for people to ask questions and and talk about things. So, I'm actually also a storyteller. That is oh, one of my other things that I do. So, um, so but you can ask more about that. You know, on Saturday. <laughs> Excellent. All right. Well, we will see you then. I appreciate all the time you've given us. We will we'll see you here later this week. Sounds great. All right. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. You stayed all the way to the end. Watch these videos right here to learn more about things going on in Overland Park and Kansas City.